Hello to our friends online. I'm Diana Perez. I'm John Mullery. Top stories on this Wednesday, May 1st. Relatives of the dead Boston Marathon bombing suspect will claim his body now that his wife has agreed to release it. Tamerlan Zarnayev's body has been at the medical examiner's office in Boston since his death. The FBI is investigating whether friends or relatives of the suspects helped dispose of evidence in the days after the bombing. Prosecutors say they found traces of ricin in the former martial arts studio owned by the suspect in this case. James Everett Dusky of Mississippi has been charged with sending poison-laced letters to President Obama, a U.S. senator, and a local judge. He, though, denies all those charges. FBI agents say Dusky bought castor beans on the Internet. Ricin is made from those beans. Girls as young as 15 can now buy the morning-after pill without a prescription. It will be available on drugstore shelves, no longer locked behind pharmacy counters. The FDA lowered the age to the buy Plan B one-step emergency contraceptive from 17 to 15. But the move falls short of a court order requiring the pill be made available to women of all ages. And then there's this from L.A. Watch the motorcyclist. Here he comes. Oh, he's going to plow right oh, no. into not one, but two wow. cyclists. Wow. Ouch. Now, the slow motion version of this crash does make it look a lot worse than it actually is. It happened on the famous Mulholland Drive, and we're told that the guy who was struck first did spend some time at a hospital, but he's already been discharged. There he is walking around. He didn't suffer any broken bones. What a miracle, if you ask me, but he did come away with what cyclists call road rash. We talked about it before, thank God. They were wearing their helmets. Yes, Look they at those were. impacts. Yeah, that, that's why they're okay. Yikes. Wow. Ouchies. All right, well, you can get more news anytime at ABCnews.com. I'm Diana Perez. I'm John Muller. Thanks for watching. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. ABC News, the country's premier news brand, where Americans go to see the whole picture. Together with Yahoo News, the world's number one news site on the web, this is America's number one digital news source.